UEFA have joined together with Ukraine's Children of Chernobyl Relief and Development Fund to provide an unforgettable experience for 150 children and orphans affected by the 1986 disaster. UEFA President Michel Platini extended an invitation to the children and their carers to watch the European Championship game between Sweden and France. And the lucky few touched down in Kiev ahead of Tuesday's game. 16-year-old Viktor Tiomny very excited to see the Euros in action. I dreamed about it, and when I heard that the Euros would be held in Ukraine, I immediately wanted to go to any of the matches. And when the opportunity came for me, I grabbed it. I am very pleased. It's estimated more than 5 million people remain in contaminated territories in Ukraine and Belarus. And many more have been affected by disabilities and chronic illness as a result of the catastrophe 26 years ago. Despite its gesture, UEFA has been criticised for its decision not to make a charitable donation to the Chernobyl victims as part of the social projects it has opted to support during Euro 2012.